What's up? Danny Hayasaka with Call One and Hell Direct, helping people do their business better. So today we're going to answer some frequently asked questions about the Logitech Zone Vibe wireless headset. Stay tuned. All right, so one of the first questions that we get or frequently asked questions that we get is what's the difference between the Logitech Zone Vibe 100, the Zone Vibe 125, and the Zone Vibe 100, a wireless, the one that I'm wearing now. And so the key difference is that these are certified for business. Now, they all uh, are the same form factor in terms of their, the over-the-ear style, uh, wearing style. Uh, they have that microphone boom that flips up and down uh, so all that's the same now one of the key differences uh, between the zone vibe wireless and the zone vibe uh, 125 is that those two include a usb receiver or dongle where the zone vibe 100 uh, does not how do i connect the headset to my computer so the zone vibe wireless headset comes already paired to the receiver that it ships with so all you have to do is turn the headset on uh, and then it's going to connect to the uh, receiver and you're going to see this little uh, indicator light uh, turn solid white and then you'll know that it's uh, paired. How do I adjust the volume? So it's really simple. There are volume up down uh, buttons on the side of the headset here and all you have to do is press the volume up or press the volume down uh, using those controls. Is the headset compatible with Microsoft Teams? So yes, as I showed you earlier, the Zone Vibe Wireless is certified for Microsoft Teams, Zoom, Google Meet, uh, Google Voice, and it works easily with other leading meeting and calling platforms. Uh, the headset is simple to use and priced for mass deployment. So there are there is a dedicated Teams version, part number 981-001156, and then there's a UC version, 981-001198. Uh, How do I mute? The microphone so to mute the microphone there's two different ways number one you can press the button on the microphone mic boom or boom mic boom mic mic boom uh, or you can flip the mic boom up to mute and flip it down uh, to unmute how long does the battery last the battery life of the zone vibe wireless is up to 18 hours of talk time with 20 days of standby time is the headset comfortable to wear now Comfort is always extremely subjective, uh, but yes. Uh, and one of the things that I want to point out is that when you look at this headset, uh, it's actually a lot lighter than it looks, right? So when you look at some of the other over-the-ear headphones that I've tried, uh, they're fairly heavy uh, in weight. Uh, this is not. This was very surprisingly lightweight. Uh, it is comfortable. It's got kind of the soft padding on the headband here. It's got really soft ear cushions, and it covers your ears uh, completely. Uh, so yes, it's a comfortable headset that you can wear all day long. All right, so where can I buy the Logitech Zone Vibe wireless headset? Funny you ask. You can buy the Logitech Zone Vibe wireless uh, on our website, or, or you can contact us directly, and all our information is gonna be in the description box below. All right, let's do some fun stuff now, and let's do some mic tests. Stay tuned. All right, so before we get into the mic test, I wanted to also add that you can manage this device via Logi Tune, and so it's a free download. You download it, and you're able to have uh, a lot of different options in terms of uh, settings. Uh, so you can adjust the side tone, the mic level, uh, the equalizer. Uh, there's headset diagnostics. So it's a great tool to have. All right, let's get into this. Uh, these mic tests. So first up, let's do uh, open office background noise. All right, so this is the sound of open office background noise. And so this is what it would sound like if you're using the Logitech Zone Vibe Wireless in an open office environment. All right, so that's the vacuum cleaner in the background. And so this is what it would sound like if you're using the Logitech Zone Vibe Wireless headset uh, and there's a vacuum cleaner running in the background. All right, those are chickens. All right, so this is what it would sound like if you're using the Logitech Zone Vibe Wireless headset and there were chickens running around in the background. So those are barking dogs. And so this is what it would sound like if you're using the Logitech Zone Vibe Wireless headset and there were dogs barking in the background. You know, one of the things to note is that this headset, despite the um, wearing style, the headphone wearing style, it does not have ANC. So that's another question that I do get uh, about these headsets. Uh, it does not have active noise canceling speakers. Uh, it just it doesn't have it. That's one way that they kept the price down. Because if you notice, these headsets, uh, our price range is only 99, uh, 100 bucks to 129 bucks. So it's very inexpensive over-the-ear style headphone, a style headset for business. All right, let's go on to the next sound. 
This is what it would sound like if you're using the Logitech Zone by the wireless headset and there's a baby crying in the background. Reporting with a heartwarming story. So Mr. Earl has so many grandkids. And so this is what it would sound like if you're using the Logitech Zone by the wireless headset and someone had the volume at full blast. Oh man. There's a blender running in the background. So this is what it would sound like if you were using the Logitech Zone 5 wireless headset and there was a blender running in the background. All right, so there you go. We answered some frequently asked questions about the Logitech Zone Vibe wireless headset and we ran it through some extreme uh, microphone tests. So all that's left is understanding your thoughts. What do you think about the Logitech Zone Vibe wireless headset? Is this something you would get? Not. Why, why not? Let us know in the comments. And as always, if you like this type of content, give us that like, subscribe, and check us out on the next video. Thanks.